Well, good morning, peeps. <laughs> I'm having a go for some big bream over here at Broom Pits near Bungie. I've been putting a few of these feeder falls out here, about 45 to 50 metres. I didn't bother uh, pegging it out to see how far it was, but I've put, this is about the sixth one out, but I didn't want to put big gear on to plumb it out with the big feeders, because I need the big rods for that, but I didn't, decided not to do that. So I'm here in the big pit, there's some big, big carp in here, but I know there's some big double figure bream as well. That's what I'm after. So what I'm doing is I'm feeding the swim up. I'll show you me mixing that later. I'm just putting it out with a, about a six square feeder, cage feeder at the moment. Got a full mixture of stuff in here. I'll show you what it is a bit later. I'll just feed it up. I'm not nipping it too tight in the cage. Just so it can come out fairly easy. Oops, that one was a bit to the right. Right, I'll carry on feeding it up and I'll be with you in a minute to show you what I'm using. That's the size cage I'm just putting out with at the moment. It's one, two, three, four, five square cage feeder. I'm just going to put a few more out before I start fishing. Whoops, there we go. That's better. I'll put a few more out. So I made it a little bit on the stodgy side, so I'll leave it out for a few seconds while I'm emptying the feeder. Right, I'll show you what I'm using in a minute. Just put a few more out. Just get a few more out there. Then I shall bait up and get, get fishing. That's the main thing, isn't it? Hey? Ho, ho, ho. I think that's about eight so far. Oop. Got the tree. <laughs> right, I'll call this one the last one for now. I'll show you what I've been baiting up with. Right, I'm now going out with my first cast with bait on. <laughs> I'll show you the pellets now I'm using. I've got some green Fuca dye on them. That's either obviously the Sensate. Right, let's see what that brings today. On the first cast, it may rod rest around like that. Here we are. <laughs> We're fishing. <laughs> Get back to you in a minute. Everybody's little favourite friend is here. Little Robin, I'll just give him a few pellets. Oh, there's another one coming. There's another one over there, look. <laughs> there's two of them. Hope they're not going to fight. Right, let's show you around the lake. That's where I'm fishing out there. Out there somewhere. Nice breeze on the water out there. There's a grebe out there. I wanted to try round there today, but there was a carp angler in the swim I wanted to f uh, fish in because I wanted to get in that narrower spot over there. Another carp, few carp anglers over there. Right, my mix is some ordinary ground bait and I had a half a tin of sweet corn left over from tea time so I put that in. I've got just a few micros which I've mixed in with the ground bait and I've got the green dye sensate in these pellets as well. So let's see what that brings us. I've got my stopwatch running at the moment you can see this. That's now on the third cast. Nothing yet. It's 10.55. That's what I see that tip go round. Well, peeps, zero zilch. I haven't even seen a touch. I think I, I, the only touch I see was I cast out once, hit the water, and as that was going down, I was waiting for it to go down. I felt a little thing like that could have been, a, you know, obviously 
caught a fish on the way down, but nothing to report to yet. I keep my fingers crossed. I keep trying different things and different ways of filling the feeder, but zilch. <laughs> blankety blank, blankety blank. Well, peeps, it was a very bad day today. All I got was one of them, just a couple of twitches, and then I got one that dropped back two inches, and I thought we were in. As it went, oh, I grabbed the rod, and off it went, you know, and that's how it is, and boom. <laughs> so I've had enough, boysy boy. I'll catch you again. Bye-bye for now.